So you're looking for an investment property. You probably have no clue where to start. There's just, you know, a Google search just takes you so much. So let me talk to you about some specific ones that I think are going to be a no brainer for you that you're going to want to jump on. And not only will it be a great return on investment for you, but you will enjoy where the property is. I'm Mary Harmon Young. I'm a realtor here in Tuscaloosa, Alabama, better known as the home of the University of Alabama. We have an incredible variety of reasons why people rent properties here in Tuscaloosa, whether they are a student at the University of Alabama, a professor at the student at the University of Alabama, coming for games, whether it's football, basketball, soccer, track and field, swimming, gymnastics, you name it. On top of that, we have Stillman College, we have Shelton State, Community College, we have the Fire College, and we have the Tuscaloosa the Amphitheater, which has been bringing in some really, really strong acts for the last year or two. So those are a few of the reasons why people come to the University of Alabama in Tuscaloosa, Alabama. But let's talk about the actual investments. It is really, really silly when I think about how many people actually come and grace Tuscaloosa on Saturdays during football season. We typically have about 100,000 in the stadium for football and easily 100,000, if not more, tailgating, whether it's right outside the stadium, on the quad, downtown Tuscaloosa, at Government Plaza, and literally on every corner. And so people want to be here, whether it's a football game, a basketball game. Like I said, they want to be a part of the action, enjoying it living it. And, you know, we just don't have that many hotels. So we do a lot of short-term rentals, especially during game day in football season. And so one of the things that's really been attractive these last, I would say probably two football seasons, are golf carts. It's really kind of taken off here in our area. You see them give, you know, people taking them to class and enjoying them on game days. So condos are the, probably the closest options and allow you to walk and enjoy game day on Tuscaloosa. You can get an entry-level condo that is kind of walking distance for easily $150,000. We can then have, you know, that gated parking or reserved parking where you can leave a golf cart for them to go explore. They're not going to be able to find parking on game day. So having a, you know, investment property that offers them where they can kind of leave their car over the weekend is going to be very attractive. I'm always blown away that not only are people coming for just football games, but they're coming for the football camps, for the cheer camps in the summer. They're coming for game days. They're coming for graduations. They're coming for parents weekend. So you think, okay, but there's only eight football games. That's not enough. Well, it may be, but besides that, you're also going to rent it for all those other times. And you know what? Our property taxes are like the second lowest in the nation. I think only second to Hawaii. So on that $150,000 condo, you may only be spending about $500 a year in property taxes. So that's something to really think about as a no-brainer not only could you come and enjoy it and get to experience the University of Alabama firsthand, but it's going to be a great rental opportunity and investment opportunity for you. So if you're not interested in that short-term rental, don't worry. We literally have tons and tons of students. We had 35,000 freshmen come last year that are always looking for apartments and homes to rent that are close to campus, as well as professors that come in, whether they're a graduate teaching position or just a short-term research position where it may only be here for a year or two. And so they choose to rent close to campus instead of purchase. So another kind of hidden gem in Tuscaloosa in the University of Alabama campus is our historic neighborhoods. They are still walking distance to the University of Alabama campus. You still get to feel like you were literally living the dream on a game day. You can hear the stadium, hear the million dollar band and feel that excitement. But you have just a little bit more space, a little bit more privacy, both inside and outside in those homes. There is our historic district in Tuscaloosa is regulated. So there are a few more rules and stuff, but nothing that's really going to affect your investment overall. So, you know, when we look at these homes, 
from a long-term standpoint, sometimes we see people that'll do a multi-year lease, whether it's a professor or a student, like I mentioned, a lot of properties get passed down the lease within their social club, whether it's a fraternity or a sorority. So that's kind of neat to be able to rent it out on a long-term basis. I've seen some that have even leased it for three or four years, depending on how long they feel like they will be in the Tuscaloosa area. Another, you know, pro if you're looking for kind of weighing your odds for an investment property is typically the homes don't have that high monthly HOA. Now, with that being said, you also are going to have to pay your own utilities because those condos, a lot of them do offer internet, water, trash, and things like that already built in through their HOA fees that are typically monthly and sometimes quarterly. So, you know, whether you're looking for a short-term rental or long-term, you can see Tuscaloosa and the University of Alabama campus offer that as a great option to you. Like I said, people always want to, you know, enjoy the University of Alabama experience and environment on a game day, whether it's a concert, we are known and people want to come to the Tuscaloosa area for that reason. They also come just for the university and other reasons. And so they might do short term, they might do long term, but either way, it is a no brainer for you. Like I said, they can start at 150. We have the low property taxes and there's always going to be a need here in the Tuscaloosa area for you. So if you have questions about finding an investment property around the University of Alabama in the Tuscaloosa area, I'm Mary Harmon Young and would love to help you.